Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm so sorry my hair is looking crazy. It's hella humid here and this is how my hair reacts when it's hot. Anyways, I just filmed this makeup look right here. That's coming up after this video, but today's video is going to be my room tour. Yes, I've been wanting to film this for so long, but I've had like so many different changes in my room, so I wanted to be as updated as I could be. And also I've had some internet issues because I don't have Wi-Fi at my house. I explain in this video that you are going to see next. I just wanted to explain that at the start I'm reorganizing my makeup, which is super fun. I love watching other people do that. So I hope you guys enjoy this. I basically buy another Alex drawer and you know, because everything's in one, so I bought another one so it's now spread out. I left the sound in because I find it so satisfying hearing like a sped up version of when people move around stuff. I don't know if you guys do, I'm sorry if it annoys you, but I love it. And then after I reorganize my makeup, I show you my whole entire room. That's basically the video. <laughs> so if you want to see that, continue to watch. I hope you enjoy. Please give this a thumbs up and I would love your feedback on anything. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you in my next video which is this look so this is the before and that's just an empty drawer that I just made took me an hour and a half and I'm gonna transfer everything like probably get rid of all that so it's less messy See, this is my face, and that's my eyes, basically. First one, we have primers, face primers, and then this one is facial sprays, and these are setting sprays. And this is my second drawer. It's just my foundations, my BB cream, which I only have three back and backups. This side is basically drugstore and then this is higher end. This is my third drawer, concealers and then cream concealers on the side, liquid highlighters and some palettes that are cream. These are my bronzing products, so sticks, liquids, and at the back are just backups of what I have in here. And then on the side, these are pressed powders and then at the back are my loose powders. So this is my face powder products. In the left hand side are all my bronzers and at the back are my jumbo bronzers and in the middle all my highlighters and obviously blushes. So And this is my last drawer, my face palettes. So over here are like my bronzer powder palettes. On this side are all my highlighting palettes and these are all my blush palettes. So that is one drawer done. This is my first drawer, so that's eyeshadow primers. These are all my eyebrow stuff, so my pomades, powders, gels, and like anything I need, whatever. My mascaras that I'm using, and then backup mascaras and backup eyebrow gels. So the second drawer, I didn't really do much organizing. I just rearranged. In this container, I have my pencil eyeliners and my glitter liners and my black liquid eyeliners. And then at the back here are all my gel eyeliners here. That's loose glitter this is liquid glitter eyeshadows and then and these are just my pot slash gel eyeshadow bases
This is my third drawer. So it has my individual eyeshadows and my smaller palettes. But this is my fourth drawer. Obviously it has my bigger eyeshadow palettes. I don't know how to make this look any cuter. I just, I don't know what to do with this. It kind of looks gross. I'm kind of flopping right now. Okay, I just made it more pretty. I just put it to the side like that. And then this also looks gross. I just need to get more like containers basically and then I'll figure it out. These are my lip liners and these have like no places like lipsticks and liquid lipsticks and then lipsticks and glosses and creams and then like a massive lip palette over there which I don't recommend it's pretty bad. Okay I just found this container but it's still kind of looking it's looking better but so because I had to install that, I had to move this whole table to the side, which I had to move that table from there to here. And then this was against this wall and now it's here. So that's what's happening with my room. I'm trying to redecorate, you know, it's the new year. So obviously I just walked into my room and the first thing you see is this. Well, I'll do a little pan shot. So I guess I'll start from here and then work my way to the left. So then I have a bean bag from Kmart and then up here is just my handbags, bum bags and belts. The bottom here is just, down here is my basket full of clothes, which you know, you can still re-wear but it's not dirty enough to put in the wash. My Uggs, this little rack, I don't know where I got from, but that has like my boots some heels and on the top is like all my workout but in here i've probably got this from like office works first drawer has all my just some of my sunglasses and glasses this is like earphones and anything iphone related wireless charger wireless headphones bottom ones more usbs that i keep all my old photos in to like back up in case technology screws me over extra charges phone cases I'm yet to fill these ones, but this is like a work in progress. This is just like all my beauty bands and ankle weights. Amino acids from Woman's Best, pre-workout protein, yoga block. And this is a yoga mat. Behind it, it's just got some hats, my roller and go bombers. You know how it is. Moving on to this stand, I got from Kmart. the three t black stand. Random decorations, candles, hand cream and some more fake plants in this little thing. I don't know where it's got. I've got my car keys, house keys, contacts, you know, my snacks and gums if I ever feel peckish. This is my bed. It is a double sized bed. And that's obviously my feature wall. Kind of cute. It used to, I used to have like a pinkish room. This little carpet is from Ikea. To the left of my bed, I have a wooden table. I recently just put this cloth on. It's from my mum's, but it like suited the attire. So I was like, wow, instead of the, um, the wood. My MacBook and my calendar. And it's got my pens and pencils. These are all my cards that I've collected over the years. Up above this is perfumes and deodorants. And then it has my name, Jose. Not Jose. Don't know where I got this from. I've had it for like years and years and years. I'm like out of breath for some reason. Oh my god. This is where I used to film my YouTube video with that natural lighting. But then I changed to here. I got a mirror and my mini ring light. And just like my jewelry stand. And you know, you see the decorations. You see it. The first tier, it has all my purses. Second, got some face halo. Some spare cotton pads. And some brush cleaners and sponge cleaners at the back. The third tier just has my like sunscreen, body lotions, hand lotions. I have this. I made some slits to put my rings, but I did order a proper jewelry ring stand, so I'm just waiting for that. But this is a cute, cheap way to do it. This is all part of my makeup collection as well. This is just my skincare in the bottom drawer. A bit of a mess, but it's still my skincare. It's just got random stuff. This is my toners, my eye creams and lash serums, my makeup removers and moisturizers, makeup wipes, my cellar waters. I feel like everyone has them. The IKEA Alex drawer. That's all my makeup brushes. Where I keep my beauty blenders foundation powder bronzer highlight and blush blending brushes shader brushes eyebrow brushes and like tools that's all my primers and setting sprays 
these are all my foundations. I'm going through this slowly because if people missed out on the actual redecorating part, they just didn't want to see it, they fast forward to this. I'm just giving you an overview, but if you want to see how I did this, it's at the start. These are my concealers, liquid highlighters, liquid bronzers, loose powders and pressed powders. This is my bronzers, highlighters, blush and bigger bronzers at the back as well. And this is all my face palettes, blush palettes, highlighting palettes. And then to the right is my eye drawer, eye primers, eyebrow pomades, eyebrow powder, eyebrow gel, mascaras. Mascaras I haven't opened yet and all my lashes are like shoved in here which I need to figure that out. Second drawer, gel eyeliners, liquid black eyeliners, pencil eyeliners, glitter liners. <laughs> This is my liquid eyeshadows. These are my loose glitters, pressed glitters, and like creamed eyeshadows. This drawer is my single eyeshadows here, and my little more smaller palette Kylie, Tarte, The Balm, Revolution, lots of ColourPop. Below are my bigger eyeshadows, and the last one is my lip, all my liquid lipsticks. Stick lipsticks, lip balms, these are more lip balms, random glosses, and some lip liners. Continuing, this is a built-in desk with my room. Here, there's just a little stand. This has my Remington straightener. Cool, I used to have a GHD, but that was just, it died on me. It was so shit for me. My little radio, random jar of beauty blender that I haven't used. This is a photo of my family, dad, mum, brother. I have my vanity, what's this called? from Kmart. Big plants, my ears. Um, at the back, if you stand back, <laughs> it's not like centered. I couldn't center the mirror to here because of these drawers. Like it just didn't work out. So I need to redo my desk because it's a bit dirty. Below my desk is just my scrunchies, hair products, nail polish, and that's my makeup bags. And this is how I look right now. It's up, but I have a nice built-in mirror. So yeah, my room is actually very spacious, which I'm very thankful for. So this side of my closet, jumpers, second are all my dresses, skirts. These are all my crop tops and like party tops, t-shirts, casual t-shirts, workout t-shirt, my jeans, shorts, trackies, skins, tights, bikinis at the back and like towels. It's a bit of a mess, sorry. And the left... So I have all my jackets here. These are all my like coat bags and like duffel bags. And that is my room. Nothing fancy, nothing crazy. I don't have a massive shoe collection. Don't have a massive bag collection. This is what I care about, the makeup. So if I don't make an outro, I hope you enjoyed. I look like Hagrid. Let me know if you enjoyed by giving this a thumbs up and I'll see you in my next one.